Every year, more than 1 billion tons of corn are harvested, mostly in agricultural powerhouses like the United States, China, and Brazil, to feed the world's food, animal feed, and industrial needs. A significant portion of that is dedicated to the familiar breakfast food, cornflakes. Behind every spoonful of cornflakes lies an incredible, precise, high-tech processing journey. All will be revealed in today's video. Before the corn kernels can begin their journey to becoming cornflakes, they must go through an essential step, harvesting on vast fields. These large corn fields are harvested using modern corn harvesting machines, equipped with high technology to optimize yield and minimize loss. These machines automatically collect the corn from the fields, cutting the corn cobs from the stalks and separating them from the husks, all done with precision and speed. Modern machinery not only ensures efficient harvesting, but also reduces human exposure to environmental factors and risks. The sensor and GPS systems on the harvesting machines help accurately locate the corn plants, ensuring no cob is left behind. Once the harvest is complete, the corn is transported in automated transport vehicles, quickly moving it to the processing plant for the next steps in production. Harvested corn is fed into a hopper, which then transfers it to a high-performance integrated conveyor system. As the corn cobs move along the conveyor, an advanced laser scanning system scans the entire surface of each cob to detect defects, foreign objects, and color differences. In this integrated process, the two ends of the corn are marked with a laser, then transferred to a closed rotary cutter with a sharp blade that cuts both ends evenly. The remaining corn falls into rotating drums, where the corn kernels are forced to roll, collide with each other and against the drum walls, removing the husks and impurities that remain on the kernels. In addition, the rotating mechanism helps prevent the corn from getting stuck or clogging as it moves along the conveyor. In the non-laser method, corn cobs are manually placed on a conveyor belt to pass through processing steps such as a double blade rotary cutter and a section cutter. After cutting, the corn sections leave the machine and move to the next processing stage. At the rotating distribution table, the corn cobs slowly slide to the beveled edge, then fall into troughs below, helping to evenly distribute the cobs to the next processing step. In the other method, the harvested corn cobs are lined up and sent to a sheller. Inside the machine, rotating brushes pull and separate the husks from the corn cobs, which are then transported by a separate conveyor to a waste container. 
the clean corn cobs are placed in a temporary container, helping to coordinate between stages. Trained workers carefully inspect them to remove any remaining impurities or foreign objects. Then enter a rotating washing drum, which uses high pressure water jets to rinse the entire surface as they rotate inside. In another method of processing, the corn cobs are transported from the temporary storage bins via a conveyor system to a kernel separator. This machine uses specialized blades to peel the kernels off the cobs. The separated kernels are transferred via chutes to the storage bins, which are then loaded onto trucks via a separate conveyor. At the mill, corn kernels are unloaded and brought to a receiving area, where they are transferred to large hoppers. Here, they are fed into rotating drums for mixing, then passed through air classifiers to separate dust and light impurities from heavier kernels. The clean kernels are then fed into a multi-stage grinding process, using specialized machinery to produce corn grits and cornmeal. The milled product is sent to large silos for storage, while the byproducts are collected separately for use in animal feed or oil extraction. Semi automated cornflake factories use a combination of manual and mechanical labor. After the corn kernels have been cleaned and processed, they are fed into a rotating cooker where water and flavoring agents are added during the cooking process. Once cooked, the kernels are transferred to a rotating drum washer where a controlled water spray removes any remaining residue. The wet kernels are spread out on trays and allowed to cool before being pressed into flakes by rollers. This is followed by air drying, after which the flakes are baked in batch ovens to achieve the familiar crispness and golden color. The final product is cooled, manually inspected, and manually packaged into bags for distribution. In contrast, highly specialized corn flake plants rely almost entirely on automation. From bulk storage, corn kernels are transferred to pressure cookers, where they are washed and cooled by blowers that circulate cool air around the rolling flakes. Flattening is accomplished using precision rollers, and moisture is managed in continuous dryers equipped with smart sensors. The toasted flakes are then passed through automated optical scanners that detect defects and grade them accordingly. These facilities can also produce cereal rings by mixing cornmeal with sugar, flavorings, and coloring, then extruding the mixture into rings before baking and packaging. Finally, the cereal is air-cooled and sent to the automated packaging area. A multi-head weigher accurately measures each portion to be filled into bags on a conveyor belt. Once filled, the bags are sealed with an automated heat sealer to ensure airtightness and freshness. 
This process of transforming corn into seamless popcorn shows the magic of modern food production, combining agricultural science with industrial engineering. If you find this behind the scenes look at the world of popcorn production fascinating, be sure to like the video, subscribe to the channel, and hit the notification bell for more in-depth information on how to make your favorite foods. Thank you.